Jay's got the door and he got the eye. The children sing. The nation's children's homes and institutions are filled with unfortunate, with unfortunate, with unfortunate. Yeah, I just got the chills. Neglected and badly treated, these children have little chance of growing up, young up into healthy, well-adjusted adults. Are you affecting Sam right now? Either way, it went from 17 to 13. 7 to 13. Oh, or it went from 7 to Oh my god, oh my god. Welcome to my house of nightmares. It's really weird how everything kind of turned where I really don't want to live here right now because it's got spirits in it. My name is Zach Wenzel, and for the past 10 years, my crew and I have been investigating the paranormal. Spending overnight in some of the most haunted locations to try and debunk claims of spirits and manifestations, I'm shaking while right also now. trying to find proof of the afterlife. Along the way, we've experienced terrifying unexplained phenomena, and have further learned the truth behind life after death. These are our journeys our adventures. We're not afraid of you. Together, we are unstoppable. Together, we are Blood Moon Paranormal. Built in 1898 by Jerome Beale. He was a Toledo native. He was a businessman. He opened up a music shop and he opened up a jewelry shop. Um, he was here to 1922. He did not pass away here. He moved to Minneapolis and sold a home to the Wolf family. It was uh, Daisy Wolf, Clarence, and their children. Clarence did have an accident out here. He got hit by a car. He went to the hospital and died two years later in the home. In 1966, Daisy uh, was bedridden for several years and she did die in the home also in 1966. Then the home was sold to Toledo Lucas County Children's Group and they opened it up in 1970 to 1995. And it was a group home for mentally challenged kids, sick children and unwanted kids. Once that shut down, a gentleman bought it in 2009. He lived in it for about a year, I heard, and then he moved out. And I don't know why. I don't know if it's because of a haunting or anything like that. But he kept it till I bought it in 2022. It's just kind of like, almost like it was calling me. Then I find out the history of this place and what's going on here. And it was just really weird how everything kind of turned where I really don't want to live here right now because it's got spirits in it. I kept hearing what sounded like somebody walking on a carpet in the hallway. I kept looking, I was sitting like sideways and I'm like facing down this hallway. Um, this shadow figure, real small, comes running up and it does like this weird jitter thing and it takes off and I'm like, did I just see that or is it because I'm focusing on this hallway for so long and the girl behind me goes, oh my God, I just saw something down there and I just validated what I actually saw. Um, but I do see a lot of shadow movement in here, footsteps. I found footprints in the carpet of like little kids' feet, bare feet. You hear voices in here. You hear stuff sound like it's being dragged upstairs. So there's a lot of activity here. Do you believe there's any demons here? I do not believe there's any demons here. I wouldn't even allow people to come in here. You wouldn't even be doing an interview here if there was. I mean, I wouldn't have that right mindset to do something like that to anybody because demonic is a completely different entity and they could terrorize you, they could hurt you, they could do a lot of damage to somebody. I wouldn't even allow that. Uh, people thought maybe in the basement because there was a biter and a scratcher down there. Remember what this place was. It had mentally challenged kids here sick children and unwanted kids. Well, what do mentally challenged kids like to do? They like to bite, scratch, and pull here to get attention. And that's what I believe is downstairs in the basement, because uh, we actually recorded a boy saying, mom, mom, mommy, mom, and daddy before down there. Have you ever had a dream that felt so real that you woke up in a panic? Well, before we start this episode, I need to tell you something that happened 
with this location before I even knew about it. You see, back at the beginning of 2023, I had a dream that we were going on an investigation to this mansion. There's a bunch of us going, it was a big crew. We were just doing a normal routine investigation of a mansion. And when we got there, we did our investigation, and eventually we all split up. When we split up, I eventually got possessed. Now, I don't believe in possession, but I got possessed in this dream. And throughout the night, I went and I killed each individual crew member and hid their body in the house. This dream I woke up to, did not know how to feel about it. A week later, I was scrolling on Facebook. Next thing you know, I come across an ad for a new place to investigate, the Bill Manor. I saw a picture of this place and it was the exact same mansion in my dream. I put my phone down, contemplated it, and I hesitated even thinking about investigating it. But here we are now. Welcome to my house of nightmares. All right, so right now, we're about to split up into trios. The boys are gonna go in the basement for 30 minutes. The girls are gonna go on the second floor for 30 minutes. And then we're gonna switch. Boys are gonna do the, the second floor for 30 minutes and the girls are gonna do the basement for 30 minutes. So, starting off with trios. Yay! How's everyone feeling? I'm excited. We got Can't wait. All right, Woo! Let's do this. So I remember the tour guide said there's a lot of activity in that corner. You want to Back over off? there, or yeah, over where here? those three tr the tr three chairs are. Yeah, we can investigate with it. Let's do it. We are good to go. Oh, All right, great. starting the timers now. Good luck. This All right. Real. Is that real? Like, like a movie reel? <laughs> you already hit the record button on this, right? Yeah. Okay. At least I think I did. Yeah, at the top. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Awesome. I missed that at first. Channeling chart energy. Channeling chart energy. Peace. Bill. Bill. Wow. Oh. Oh. Like B I L L, but that's still. That's pretty that's, wild. That's, that's, how that's pretty say good. That. You were asking how to pronounce it earlier. <laughs> that's pretty crazy. We're going to be here. We got a lot of different toys and things for you to play with, so feel free to. Numbers 50. Numbers 50. Go play with that box on the table. Let us know you're here with us. Did you hear that? Yeah, that was loud. Let us know you're here with us. That wouldn't have been them. I don't think so. Evan? Wicked. Wicked. Did you like the flashing light? Mason? Like the name? Is there any other device you can use down here to show me that you're here? I just want to see what you're capable of. That was a knock Oh yeah. Voice. Show me that was you. Knock on anything down here, we'll hear you. Show us you're here. You hear that? I hear anything. There's like a little like, tap over that way. Mason, was that you? Sure. Oh, oh my god, dude. <laughs> Thank you. We aren't entirely sure if these unexplained noises are the girls two floors above us or settling noises, but this confirmation from a supposed spirit named Mason has us interested. Regardless, we still have to take all of this with a grain of salt. So there's someone named Mason down here. Can you tell me why you're here? Later. Hunt. I'm just gonna like tell us later. We gotta like find him. We gotta find him. It says hunt. Do you want ever. density fight ever? Okay, timer is started. Cool. Flashlight. Flashlight. Nice. Can you see it? I can see. I saw it light up. Cool. Oh my god! Hello. Hi. Welcome in. That was cool. Well, welcome in. Whoever just turned that on, thank you. Yes, thank you. We just wanted to come and talk to you. We brought a bunch of toys you can play with. Right there. If you tap them, there's a bunch around here and in the hallway. If you want to make them light up like that, you have to just touch them. And you already figured out the flashlight. Mm-hmm. We have an EMF. Yep, it went off again when, when you said Did it? you really? figured out the flashlight. Yeah, it lit Good up. Good job. Is there something over there you want to show us? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do you want me to roll the basketball to you? Did you want to play with it? 
what was that? That was that like was loud. Tink. Not a tink, but like oh. was that a tink or was that it something wasn't a, like a heat or something clicking on? Ah, uh, maybe. But that. the heat though is that Almost kind of heat, radiator. so it's not. It wouldn't make oh, that noise. Shit. That's a yeah. It also sounded like an IR light, but why would the IR yeah. be going on and off right now? Maybe we that should go by the stairs of the attic. By the attic. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Like right now, or did you want to try a spirit box? Oh, well, you can try it in here, spirit box in here, and then if anything, just in that hallway oh, area. Yeah. Who are you? What's your name? That was weird. Oh, you didn't hear that? It sounded like a boom. Yeah, like a, like a laugh. Are there kids in here with us right now? Oh, yeah. Can you say, oh, yeah? Yeah, that's what uh, it sounded like. Talk? Now recording, uh, Bill Basement, second EVP session. Can you tell us why you're here? If you can, specifically, why are you in the basement? Can you tell us your name? Cool. It's like really slow. Now recording, uh, Bill Basement, second EVP session. Can you tell us why you're here? This EVP we just captured was fairly quiet and took us some time to figure out. What we think is being said is don't. Don't leave me here. Could this possibly be a child begging his parents not to abandon him? Here it is again, a little more enhanced. I hear two. I hear two are so, talk. So right here this yeah. is why i brought that big speaker we can blow that up and see what we it could. says we could well, yeah well rain radio do you want us to run spirit box who wants us to use this did that say mason it didn't sound like mason to me but Thank you for listening. <laughs> hmm. Well, thank th you thanking us for turning this on. Very. All right, our trios are over, and we're gonna be swapping places. How'd it go for you guys? So we stayed in the in the crib room the whole time. We yeah. lost track of time. Um, the only thing that went off was the flashlight. Like we had a constantly. couple of spirit box responses. Yes. In Ovulus. In yes. Ovulus. But Maglite was consistent in the crib. We had two Maglites, only the one in the crib. When it was going off? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Okay. A lot. A lot. And kind of like responding to our questions going off too, so. Yeah. Cool. Uh, I think we got an EVP. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of quiet. I can't understand what it's saying, but it's there. Mm -hmm. Okay. So. Bye. Nice. All right, guys. Have All fun right, upstairs. Up. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. All right, guys, you ready? I'm going, I'm going. The walkie talkie stuck in the pocket. <laughs> Too much is going on. Maglite. The demon's got us. Maglite on. Yeah, Maglite turned on in there. Oh, shit. Um, no, we're good now. Sorry, I was setting up a light. Shh. Okay, set oh. the timer. Maglite. Really? Yeah. Oh yeah, it's like just flashing. Is it like flickering, or is it like, do no. I need to fix it no, kind of look. flickering? Season. I heard exact. Oh, Lord. Hear me now? Yeah. If there's anyone up here with us, can you please give us a sign? dripping noise in there or is it like a tap? I can't tell. Sometimes I th it almost sounds like a faint like EMF like static. Yeah. But the light's not lighting up. What the fuck was that? I heard the floor creak over there. It was like a shuffling noise. Yeah. This creaking makes it sound like someone is walking around in the children's room, but everyone on this floor is within sight. Sam is directly to my right, and Jason is down the hall crouched with his camera. So what's causing these noises? 
What the fuck was that? I can't tell if it was this room or... Can you tell us what floor the boys are on right now? Mad that was upstairs. The, the mad that? is on here. There was a knock, another knock upstairs. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh no, it's just so hard. That's so Ooh, weird. Oh, did you hear that upstairs? I did. I did. And. Turn it off. Yeah, can you just listen for a second? But also, right when the right mag light went minutes. off, right when this one went off, that one turned on. Oh my god. Do you hear that? Ball bag move. I thought someone was walking next to me. Jesus. Oh my right. god. I made that noise. Okay. Hold on, hold on. What if it's like, hold on, what if it's like walking upstairs, but it's making the noise like, if it's on the board of like one of these pipings, like the piping will make the noise from down here, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like it'll make, cause it's like hitting it kind of. Dude, it is so quiet up here. It, yeah. It feels like unnaturally empty right now. Maybe this is what he was talking about, where it's like, if so, if it stops and it's not active, move on. Yeah. I wonder if we try it. the Spirit Talker app again. Yeah. <laughs> We're just here to talk. We're not here That's to hurt you. Really interesting that it just said that. Oh, what did it say? It said it didn't say it out loud. If you want to bring the camera over here real quick, so we can see it. It said Margaret. Can't see that. Uh, kinda, yeah. Margaret's one of the owners, I think. Like when it was the group home. Can you tell us? Uh, can you maybe tell us what country you're from? Did you come from a different country? And what country was that from? I'm in my 40s. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. The group home was what it was before it was privately owned? Yeah. It's not me. <laughs> 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 Did you hear that? It's not me. <laughs> <laughs> Even they're like, no, that's the cars, man. <laughs> that was a weird noise, though. I don't know what that was. Despite these few bits of activity, the house was quiet for the rest of our trios. Our trios are over. Meet up on May 4th. What's up? How'd it go? Lots of maglite. Lots of yeah. maglite again. <laughs> Both of them. We have the name Margaret, which is a actually... A popular name, isn't that here? It's a popular name here because that was the name of the woman who ran the group home. Oh! Yeah. That's right. So I think so. I'm pretty I, sure I didn't, it's, I didn't I'm pretty sure it's Margaret so Kindred. Oh. Um, okay. Now that our trios are over, it was time to start investigating together. We decided to first head up to the third floor. And go. Hey, do something. <laughs> well, shit, I don't know. <gasps> yeah! no! <laughs> yeah! Dude, yeah. no way! That was awesome. awesome. No way! Thank Are you for doing that. Yeah, thank, thank you. Do that you. Oh, oh, wait, wait. Hello? Hello? Whoa. Wait, hold on. Not to be like that, that literally looked like a camera flash. Yeah, it did. Were you mimicking Emily doing a camera flash? Because I was right about to press my button, too. We can play yes and no with the flashlights. If you want to play, flash it twice for yes and flash it once for no. If no, we can find another game. That's, that's yes. That's two. That's two. That's yes. Two yeah, it's a two, two, for two, yes. two for yes. Two for yes. Okay, two for yes. let's ask okay. yes and no questions. Oh, wait, we oh, had another one. I just said no. <laughs> Because you, because you thought you got it, you said it wrong. Oh, so it said no. no. Said no. Oh, like Carly, they're going. They're gone. Sorry, they're going. Sorry. For the next couple of minutes, we continued asking questions, but no more flashlight responses occurred during that time. Do you want to play a different game? Flash once for yes. Flash twice for no. 
Whoa. Oh. Okay, we can play a different game. Did it flash? There was only once. It was yeah. really quick. Just light it up if you want us to bring out a different piece of equipment. So talk you can to us. Talk to us easier. Did you hear that? I heard something behind me. That sounded kind of like an arrow. No. No, dude, that sounded like your camera. I like it made that. it, it made the like sound rattling. like it was like a shutter. It was like yeah. a shutter sound. We aren't sure exactly what this unexplained noise was, but it sounds like it's mimicking Emily's camera once again, but this time with the shutter instead of the flash. Listen closely as we compare the two sounds. Did you hear that? I heard something behind me. That sounded kind of like an arrow. Did you hear that? I heard something behind me. That sounded kind of like an arrow. Did you hear that? I heard something behind me. That sounded kind of like an arrow. It sounded like your camera going off, but it wasn't your camera. It wasn't the your flash camera. Didn't no, I know. It, it didn't, in my personal opinion, it didn't sound like my shutter. It sounded slightly different, but it had the same, like, speed. Do we want to try an obvious? I was about just doing Estes. Okay. Flashlight okay. again. Oh my god. Where are you here from? Joliet, Illinois. From Joliet, Illinois. Where and are you from? Who are we talking to? It's just said where. That's where? where? That's weird. That's weird. I don't know. I'm still so skeptical on that app because know, it I'm literally so. just repeated. Where are you from? I'm back here. Is Zach's attachment here from Velisca? Have you been here before? <clears throat> no, no, we have no. not. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. Mm. Ooh. Seven. How many? Two, That's four, six? Six and then one and company. Then we're talking to. Yeah. yeah. You want to be close to Zach? Do you like him? Can you set off both cat balls? One more. Oh. What do you say? He said one more. And then the cat ball went off. Can you tell us your name? I mean, I thought I heard something. I think. I thought I, thought I, it, I, thought I heard it say, I'm Gordon. Well, of course. Cat He's ball. dangerous. Oh. Mm. Who's dangerous? Who are you talking about? Or is it saying Zach's dangerous? That's why I'm trying to get him to say it through so we have more of a... I don't trust that. Here app. for me. You okay? You okay? You okay? I heard that. What? what was that? What? Something moved over there. Something moved over there. Remember, there are bats in there. I don't. It didn't no, that sound didn't like sound like a bat. I know. I'm just saying. There's like no, animals. Like, that was not a bat. What did Zach just it say? It's my family. Hold on. What did Zach just say? I don't know. You're late. Did it, he say I'm late? I it's a shortcut, and then I heard like a child laugh. And did you want to come by me? Yeah, just come over here. That was weird. Was Zach's dream? Um, did you guys know that Zach was gonna have that dream? Did you put that dream in his You'll head? You'll find safety. Did you put that dream in his head before we came here? Can you hear me? Zach can hear you, we can't. Living. We are living. You got a point. I understand that, but... It sounds like they're talking to each other. Yeah, residual. Mm -hmm. Hey, can you tell us if this app actually works? Like, are you able to talk to us through it? Can you help us confirm that that's what you're saying through the phone by telling Zach? I told you I'm in my 40s. Ooh. I got fucking goosebumps right now, dude. <laughs> Wait, didn't it say it was it like to you guys? Yes. Yeah. Were you yeah. up here? Or no, you weren't even up here. We were here? down. Were you one, in the we second? were down one more, yeah. Interesting. Wait, did you get that through the Spirit Talker app? No. No, no, I'm for them. Oh. Yeah. You got yeah, 40 yeah. through this. Yeah. Hold on, wait, real quick. How we were like, is that you actually saying stuff? Yeah. And it just said that, and they got that through the Spirit so Talker app. Up. That lines up. That lines yeah, up. that does okay. line up. Okay. Can you help us confirm that that's what you're saying through the phone by telling Zach? I told you I'm in my 40s. I'm in my 40s. <laughs> okay. Make that cap will go off, or either either one of these two right here. <laughs> I'm preparing. I can't see the stairs. Look at it. There's nothing here. 
What did he just say? Oh, right oh, oh, he said, oh, oh, he said oh, look at oh, He said, look at there's nothing here. I thought I saw like a little kid's head like peeking up from the stairs, kind of. Come hit the ball in front of me. Let's sit by each other. <laughs> yeah. I've heard, god damn it, like three different times over the past like minute. What's wrong? Oh. Are they trying to set off the cat balls, but they can't? Nope. <laughs> I'll prove I'm here. Oh, wow. Oh, <laughs> I'll prove I'm here. Okay, prove I'm okay. If you really want to prove you're here and will really impress Gaining me. Gaining more energy. Oh. oh. Uh, I'm gonna jump. Oh, oh. Then jump, please. Then jump. Do it. As high as you can. Wait, hold on. I don't want to be encouraging this, Carly, because it's like... Why? Three. I'm gonna jump. Wait, is it like counting down? Wasn't there a possible suicide? That's thing? what I'm saying. Oh, I saw oh, something. That was my hand. Around. Sorry. No, no, that was not your hand. Are you sure? I'm positive. I saw your hand. Oh, okay. Is it like a head? Holy crap. And you just said there was a possible suicide here, so I'm not trying to encourage that. While I'm under Estes, Angie and Sam start seeing something peeking its head out from the doorway by the stairs. So Jay decides to head over there to see if he can capture it on camera. Jay's got the door and he's got the eye. The out. children sing. The oh, what? The, the children, children sing. sing. Flashlight. Oh god. They're afraid. Yeah, you're I'm moving it. it. Oh, the, the flashlight. flashlight. Good job. Can you have it roll? They're alive. They were they were saying they're afraid. They're turning on the light it's for us. You could be. Can you tell us if you're one alive? day. Okay. It's cold over here. Yeah, I just got the chills too. Mm -hmm. Can you tell us if you're alive or not? Do you know that? Wait, is this 13% on the thing? From darkness. I'm coming down the steps. And you going, you're going downstairs? Okay, hold on. Because it literally said, is this, thir is this 13 or 31? Hmm? I don't is know which way it's supposed to fit. What's wrong? 13. Yeah. It was at okay. Then that means it there was, was a day that I had a wedding. Like seven when I turned it on. What is happening? Yeah, I think that's the team. But why was it at seven percent then? Because the I'm seven a, was on this side, I think. Are you affecting Sam right now? Either way, it went from seventeen to thirteen. Seven to thirteen, oh. or it went from seven. Whoa! To, what? Whoa. Oh my god! Oh my god! <gasps> What the fuck? What? Oh my god. That just turned on. Holy f That, and also, can I tell you guys, with those lights, the first click, it's one bulb. The second click, it turns them on. Were you guys hearing noises over here too? Yeah, I, yeah, I, I was seeing the faces. Like, oh, let's just show this real quick. Knob, right here, ready? Right, knob? Mm -hmm. Yep. One that's bulb. one light, right? Yep. That's, that's all, all that's of it. That's not even all of them. That's, that's, that's all of it. You have to turn so it like three times. Here's off. This is where it was at. It skipped this, skipped this, and went all the way to this. That's, what? dude, that's mind blowing. <laughs> I can't give you an explanation. <laughs> oh, I really can't. Flashlight. The flashlight's oh, going off. My God. Wow, dude, that's amazing. Oh. Okay. That's like incredible. So you know those classic stories where people are like, I'm living in a haunted house and, and... Is it like a, like I... It's not a... You were all After this unexplained experience, we decided to end our session in the attic, take a quick break to recoup, and get back to investigating on the second floor. Because of the crazy activity we got upstairs while doing Estes, we're gonna keep doing Estes down here, except this time, we're doing a triple Estes session. Each person, in each room has a different spirit box on a different sweep rate. And we're gonna see if we can get some answers and see if we can get some activity in each room, see where most of the activity is coming from. So Emily's in here by the scrying mirror. Angie is gonna be doing her Estes session here in the kids' room. And people Carly, love dying? People love dying, is that what she said? Sam? Testing, yeah, she, she knows that. Yeah. Oh, so what? Can you tell us your names? Hi. How have you been? 
Good. Whoever was playing with us in the attic, are you down here with us? Tonight. Wait. I'm around. You. Holy shit. Sam, that just answered your question. What did it say? It said, I'm around. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> Help me. Hey. It's down by me? Down on me. Again, I'm gonna hey, ask it again. Why hey, Zach. What? Don't stop. Emily just said the same thing Angie just said. Down by me? Yeah. Can someone in this house tell me why this place was in my dreams? I'm back. Break it. It's fame. Only if you do. Now I'm gonna ask this right now. Is Reverend George Kelly here? I just did. Help you. I'm across. Help you. Get off me. Can Zach. You? Okay. Did someone want me to come here? Together. Together. I'm back in. Oh. More. Who's more? Fuck, dude. Oh, I hate that. Um, who's back in? At this point, I started to get uncomfortable and slightly overwhelmed. Little did I know, this house was charging up and ready to give us even more. Please stop calling. I'm not going to stop calling until you answer. My turn. Am I far? Sam, are you moving? No. Yeah. Whoa. What the she fuck won't. Get out that? of my room. Welcome to day. Holy shit, dude. I just entered the room Emily's in. And it's not right here. Standing. I'm, my own life. I'm fairly confident she cannot see me right now. I can't. Oh I'll my god. You out. The hallway? You're mine? I don't want to. Eyes. What the fuck was that? Little. Did you hear that tick noise? I did. What was that? Do you hear that? That bang? Yeah. yeah. By the river? Heard that oh, one too. Forget. What was... That was like a trumpet. It didn't dawn on me until I started reviewing the footage, but to me this sounds like a piano playing. The owner, Carlo, did tell us that sometimes the piano in the garage can be heard playing by itself. Let's listen again. By yeah. the river? Heard that one too. Forget. What was... Forget. What was... Forget. What was... Dude, it's starting to tweak me out a little bit. If you're here with us, can you give us a sign? I know you want it. Moves like Jagger just played. I have Sorry. been. <laughs> I have been? Can you give us a sign? I have been. That's what I mean. I think they're all talking I'm to going to her. I'm going to her? Who are you going to? Turn to the left. Oh. Check again. Yeah. Oh, did you hear that, Zach? No. What? What Carly said turn to the left, Angie said check again, and then she said your name. Dude, I am tweaking out right now, man. I am feeling so uncomfortable. <laughs> I, it just got really cold. Tell him go. I see you. Dude. Oh. This is fucking... Oh. Dude, this is fucking tweaking me out, man. You need to stop for a second? No, 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 keep going. I am gonna close this. Do you need I something? Said. Don't call me now. I'm right here. Dude, stop. <laughs> Tell me what your name is. Flashbacks, huh? Dude, what the fuck? <laughs> Turn that thing down! Who are you? If you want me. For some reason, it really feels like whatever or whoever is in this house is coming after me. I'm not entirely sure why, but I'm not the only one who notices it. This is like genuinely like creeping me out right now. It's like honestly oh, you? really freaking me out. Even like I, I feel- Zach, how's it been? Dude, I'm so, like, this is fucking tweaking me out, man. I feel so on edge right now. It keeps calling you Happy out, Happy to there. see you. Are you scared yet? That's what I feel it. I say we stop here. Yeah? Yeah.
Did you get stumped? <laughs> wow, man. What's happening? All right, we're gonna pull everyone out. Time yet? Let's pull everyone out. <gasps> we're, we're done. Oh my God, I'm sorry. bro! I'm Holy sorry. fuck! This is a really dumb way to get your attention. Down. It was really weird because like you didn't get a lot of responses, oh, but the responses yeah. you had were correlating with them. Like something was having a conversation. Oh really? With, like other spirits, yeah. Huh. I didn't say your name. It sounded like it said your name. I said something else, <laughs> but it said your name. I think. You guys, you guys were like doing different things. So like, sometimes you guys would complete each other's sentences. Oh, everybody's what? Sometimes you guys would be conversating with each other. And like, sometimes the person that was talking, it seemed like they would swap between rooms to talk and come through. I would say, right? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The whole thing is just fucking tweaking me out right now. Like. Yeah. Do you want to go get something to drink and kind of chill out, get some fresh air? Um. Because I can go for some fresh air after yeah, running 50 for, for how long that bathroom was? break too. Yeah, you do. Take a quick break, sir. What time? Okay. This place was truly affecting me, so we decided to once again take another break. We can only see the outside row. Mm -hmm. We'll leave it. Okay, 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 I'm just trying to not stand in the camera's way. Did you hear that? I yeah. heard that was like a scream. Yeah, it Those are going like off. a scream or a whistle. Is it someone outside? I don't think so. Not like to it's be a wheezy person, but that could have been me wheezing, not gonna lie. No, that was like a scream. That wasn't. Yeah, that sounded far away. We'll leave it. Okay, I'm just trying to not stand in the camera's way. Okay, I'm just trying to not stand in the Okay, I'm just trying to not stand in What's the name of the girl that was in this room right here? That stayed in there? Benjamin. Wrong. Benjamin. Uh, I don't think that's right. Incorrect. Oh, oh, Bobby! Oh. That's... That's weird. Bowie again. Is that you, Benjamin? I'm happy they like Bobby here. Mm-hmm. Oh, the stairs are Yeah, that, it was the bottom line. It keeps going off. Do you like cupcakes? We have cupcakes in the other room. Did you find them? <laughs> I was gonna say, hold on. That was... That was loud. Was that one of you guys? No, I'm trying to it. shift my weight was, right now because I have a cabinet was, behind me. Did you hear the piano? No, that sounded like plastic dragging did you on the piano. You didn't hear that? That doom. I heard something, yeah. No. I heard it. I just heard the piano. No, I definitely heard that. I thought that sounded like a piano. Oh, I didn't hear anything. Just like a couple of hours ago, we once again hear what sounds like a piano playing. This time, it sounds even closer, which would make sense because we're now closer to the garage than we were before. I have a river? Heard that one too. Forget. What was? No, I'm trying to shift my weight was, right now because I have a cabinet was, behind me. Did you hear the piano? No. I'm trying to shift my weight right now because I have a cabinet. I'm trying to shift my weight right now because I have a cabinet behind. I know the chances of us like hitting the exact key that it hit are very slim. But two people should go in there and see if they hit a key if it could be heard that loud because I heard what you heard. No, we are going to go in here and. See if this is what the guys heard. Middle you key. said it was like a milky? Yeah. Yep. Oh, oh. Um, um, um. Give it a couple of seconds. That's really loud though. I feel like we would have all heard that. It was pretty loud when me and Sam heard it. Yeah. Like, I, was, oh, I feel like Bobby. they pressed it with like more force. <laughs> Don't tell. And? It was like the same volume. Yeah, me and Sam heard it. Like, I, we, we went, boom, you know? Yeah. Like, we put force on that. Did you want us to come in there? He likes you. Huh? It sounded like something grabbed a door handle. Yeah. I saw when Angie turned around. Yeah. I heard that as well. Whoa. Whoa. A lot of them just went on on the stairs. Like, the whole first staircase all lit up at the same time. Bottom or top? Whoa. Uh, so a few on this first set. No, like literally like the, every single one going up to that first landing. Yeah. I'm just so torn with that because it's like... Let's hit, hit the basement for a little bit. Do our double S's down there. Basement, double S's. Double mm -hmm. S's in the basement. So we've been to every single level so far. We've investigated every single area we possibly can. We're in the basement right now and we're about to do a double S's session down here because this is where we were told Double Estes does the best at, so we're gonna give it a try and see. Already got some flashlights going. 
So we're gonna, we're gonna do this double S's here. You good? Mason, are you here? Oh. A flashlight. Mason, you can talk to them. No. Mason, now we can hear your voice if you talk to them through those headphones. I will threaten. Be nice. Stop. I am. Be nice, I am. That's weird though, because they're connected to the same spirit box. Yeah. So it's like they're having a conversation back and forth with each other, but. Mm -hmm. Did someone what? you want? Did a little kid commit suicide here? S see oh, some. Yeah. Oh, the bear. We kept going with this double Estes for a while, but a lot of what came through seemed either random, residual, or completely irrelevant. Yeah, so we asked a lot of questions, and I don't even think one lined up with anything we I said. Yeah. I feel like a lot of the stuff that I was saying was, to me, if I'm being completely honest, felt like I was reaching. Like trying to figure out what it said, it felt super garbled. We are back in the attic. Um, we didn't really get much in the basement, so we're gonna come back up here and uh, see what's going on because earlier it was a little weird. So we're gonna see if we can figure this shit out. <laughs> yeah, who are you? We haven't gotten like a definitive name. Save me. Whoa. Yeah, we didn't get like a name to the You guys hear that noise in there? No. Yeah, I heard so the tap. You heard that? Yeah, yeah, there was a noise in that room. The closet. If you want us to save you, we need to know who you are. Ooh. Ooh. Sorry, they didn't say anything. It just got, like, there was no oh. noise at all. Okay. Oh. Hello? <clears throat> Can you please tell us your name? Sound like Mary. Okay. We finally got a name through the spirit box then. So you a little girl then? It's a girl. Can you light up the mag light? Big head. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Damn, Angie. Damn. I just said big head to you. Holy shit. Do you need some I I, ice I, on I, the bar? I have an average sized head just so everybody is on it. So, so why does this attic seem to be a big source of the energy of what's going on here? Racist. <laughs> oh my god! Jesus! <laughs> Who are you calling a racist? <laughs> I'm, I'm I so just, confused. I just want <laughs> double confirmation. I'm so glad I just had a big moment. I was gonna say, <laughs> dang, it's <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. At, least, at least you're not apparently racist. <laughs> dang, it's like Ghost calling out. Saying Zach is racist. It's like calling you guys out so many names. Carly, it feels good not to be Doesn't the only it feel one. Great, Emily? Oh, me and Carly are like, yes, bully someone else. No, exactly. I'm okay. still trying to get to the bottom of what's going on in this in this area because, like, again, it just seems like a lot of energy is is coming around through here for some reason. Mm hmm And uh, you're a dumbass. I just called you a dumbass. Yes, it did. The responses coming through were almost aggressive, but based on the location we're at, I believe it may be a child messing with us. I decided to ask some offbeat questions to see if this is something intelligent or residual. Sit down. What's your favorite color? Your friends? Mm. Who was president when you were alive? He knows. What was your favorite shoe brand to wear? Infant? Did you have a favorite book to read? What was that book? You're a freak. Run. I don't think that's a book. Trying to help me? I was trying to talk to you. Your markers. What's your favorite color marker? There's several. Oh, you like several colors? I want it. You want a marker? You're going. Where am I going? To get markers? <laughs> <laughs> and? And? And there's more. <laughs> there's and more. there's more. There's more markers. <laughs> I'm just confused. I'm kind of I'm kind of doing this on purpose though to kind of prove that there's not intelligent responses coming through. Yeah. Because if it was intelligent, it would be responding to my question about markers. Yeah. Oh, what's going to be friends? Rest. Tired. Or are you going to visit me in my dreams again? Show me the house some more. Everyone, like with a question mark. Dude. 
Uh, if I have a dream about that. I'm going to be a little tweaked out if uh, everybody has a dream about this place now. I can't wait to have it. <laughs> So our night at the Bill Manor has come to an end. You know, I had this this house in my nightmares. Finally coming to it and trying to experience it has been absolutely incredible. You know, a lot happened in that dream that obviously didn't happen tonight. There was no way that that was gonna happen in the first place. It was a very successful one in my opinion. I didn't really know what to expect going in. Like I, I wanted to keep an open mind just didn't know how much activity could be less, could be more. So I just kind of went in, just positive attitude. And it started off like kind of like a little wave, you know, but then as the night went on, it started to pick up. The mood started to change. I would say overall the night tonight went pretty freaking well. Every floor was completely different. I think as we went up, the weirder it got. From the beginning, the activity was crazy. Um, I think one of the weirdest things that happened was time was odd. I felt like we were here for hours and only 30 minutes has passed. And then randomly, I felt like we had been doing Estes for 10 minutes and the next thing I knew it was four hours later. It was a great evening. A lot of a lot of crazy stuff going on here. A lot of, uh, a lot of communication from a lot of different areas in the house. Every floor had a different vibe and it just kept progressing in a different way. And I think that's really what makes this manor just different. Attic space was something I haven't experienced since I was a kid growing up in a haunted house and just getting that real uncomfortable feeling sometimes. Feeling that again for the first time in years, something I wasn't expecting tonight. I think there are more questions than uh, answers for this location. And I wanna come back and try to see if we can figure that out even more. That light going off in the attic was insane. I thought the Davies house was crazy with that light bulb flickering, but this just surpassed it by a crazy amount. But honestly, at the end of the day, this place was really positive. Um, I feel bad for a lot of the spirits that are here as it seems like the children's spirits seem to be just very lonely and like that they're stuck in this pattern almost. Positive from what I think we've gotten and I would love to come back and do it all over again and see what other stuff, other questions we can get answered. Overall, it was a really good investigation. There are some wild experiences here that I'm still gonna be thinking about for days to come, and I recommend this place to anybody who would like to visit the manor. Can't wait to do it again. So this is the House of Nightmares. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode. We'll see you on the next one.